If you're watching this video, odds are you want to work out how to hook up one of these to one of these. You're only going to need a couple of different connections, but you need to work out which type of connection your monitor uses, and then you're in business. Luckily, I've got both kinds with me right now, and if you need a third option, I'll explain that a little bit later. Let's check it out. This is my 4K Acer monitor. As you can see, there's three different types. Most lower resolution monitors, so full HD ones for example, probably won't have the display port. And if you're not sure what is what, simply go over to the back of the monitor and look at the actual labeling. Usually they're labeled. The DVI is this one. This is an older generation technology. And we have a HDMI connection and that's the display port. So whatever you're currently plugged into, that's what you're gonna have to find as an adapter. With the newer generation monitors, they're always HDMI and DisplayPort, and these are kind of like a fail-safe backup, but we're gonna look at these two today. Now, here's the side of my MacBook Air. This is a 2017 model. As you can see over here, the one marked with the little lightning thing right here is the one that we're gonna to use to go from this out into the actual monitor. This is a Thunderbolt port. This is also my first time hooking this up. I'm gonna see if we can output from the MacBook Air to 4K. If it doesn't work, I'll use the HDMI cable, but we should be good to go. So I do have a DisplayPort one. So we're gonna try this one first, and as I open this and hook it up, I'll show you what I'm doing. This is the side that we're gonna hook up to the Mac, and this is the side that's gonna to go to the actual monitor. So let's give it a go. All right, so firstly, I'm gonna hook up the DisplayPort adapter to the monitor so I can then swing the monitor back around and we can have the monitor facing forward, which makes it a lot easier. So now, in theory, all we need to do is hook this up into the MacBook Air and we should be good to go. And I just realized the cable's on the right, so I'll recable this around the other way in a bit. Let's turn on the Mac and see what happens. Nothing yet. This is the first time that I've hooked it up, so it may take a moment. If we can get 4K display out of this, I'm gonna retire my actual PC desktop unless I'm playing some games. <laughs> Let's see what happens. All right, I'll sign in. We have a screen already, beautiful. It's lit up, that's a good sign. And there it is. So I guess what we want to do now is see what actual display we're running at. I typed in displays. As you can see, I've got the built-in display running at 1440 by 900 and the Acer CB281 HK display, which is the 4K monitor which you're looking at, running at 4K, so 3840 by 2160. Awesome stuff. That's gonna make life a whole lot easier. This is where I'm gonna be docking this little MacBook Air, and it's really, really that simple. Now, the third option was that white DVI cable. You probably need a HDMI to DVI converter for that to work. So if I find a link for that, I'll also put that down in the description as well. Thanks again for watching. My name's Shane. I hope you enjoyed this video. If it was helpful, please give it a thumbs up. If it wasn't, please give it a thumbs down and give me some feedback on why and how you think I can improve these videos moving forward. Thanks again, guys. Catch you soon. See ya.